Since 2001, Canadian Solar has been a leader in the solar industry due to our continuous innovation and investment in research and development. With our latest technological innovation, KU modules, customers can expect up to 3.5% lower levelized cost of electricity. KU is a play on words for cool because KU modules operate cooler than standard PV modules. The main differences between KU modules and standard PV modules are dual cells and dual module design. Dual cells are half the width of standard cells. Cells with half the width generate half the current. Because the power loss goes as the square of the current, dual cells generate only one quarter of the power loss, which means less heat generated. Because the module operates cooler and has a better temperature coefficient, it can generate a higher power output. Polycrystalline KU modules are available at the same power classes as standard monocrystalline modules. Next, let's look at dual module design. KU modules operate like two modules in one, which gives KU modules better shading tolerance. With a standard PV module in portrait orientation, when the bottom portion of the module is shaded, the entire module stops producing. With KU modules, when the bottom is shaded, only the bottom half of the module stops producing. This allows you to optimize your system design for tighter inter-row spacing. Let's look at a real-life design example, comparing our 350-watt poly-KU modules to our competitors' 350-watt standard mono modules. We've got 19 acres of land, which fits 34 rows of modules, with 9-meter spacing between the rows for 6 megawatts total. Here's our competitors' standard mono system. And here's the Canadian Solar KU Poly Module System, with the exact same 6 megawatt design. Our KU Poly Modules produce 2.2% more energy, that's a 2.2% lower LCOE on an apples-to-apples -apples basis. Now, let's take into account the better shading tolerance of KU modules. Our competitors can still only tolerate the 9 meters spacing we saw before. Notice that at the beginning and end of the day, shading from the adjacent row knocks out power production from an entire row of modules. But with KU modules better shading tolerance, the system design is optimized at 7.5 meter spacing. Now we can fit 39 rows of modules in the same parcel for 6.9 megawatts total. At the beginning and end of the day when shading occurs, the top halves of the modules are still producing power, even when the bottom halves are partially shaded. Factoring in the additional equipment cost, KU modules deliver a 3.5% lower LCOE. In summary, Canadian Solar KU modules give you higher kilowatt peak power, more energy output, and better shading tolerance. All of this results in a 3.5% lower levelized cost of electricity. Canadian Solar KU modules are another way that we deliver customers greater value through advanced technology. We look forward to talking to you about how we can make the difference on your next solar project. <music>